Greetings everyone and welcome back. I hope you're all doing well today. We're checking out strange anomalies photographed by Perseverance Rover in Jezero on Sol 4, 200, 205 and 206. More strange megalithic blocks in this one so let's get cracking on. Yeah, we're looking at Sol 200 and this photograph of that strange object over there guys check this out it's got like a pyramidal shape to it and then this strange carving over here on the side and there's one similar to this that I'll show you in a moment but check out the symmetry and geometry in this piece I estimate it to be about a meter just over a meter long then we're looking at Photographs. This is a gigapan that Joe from Art Alien TV put together. We'll have a look at that towards the end of the video. Yeah, we'll be zooming in on that block over there and this one over here. So check this out, folks. This is from Sol 205. And there's a look at that strange megalithic block or slab. It looks like this was a structure that's been totally decimated and eroded over time and these blocks are tightly packed together and uh, then we're looking at that strange piece I estimate this to be about a meter meter and a half to two long but check out the perfect piece over here guys We've got uh, straight edges and right angles going on again. And it looks like this piece was cut to fit in underneath that part over there. Very much like the blocks that we find at ruins down in South America. And there they are for comparison. Check out this shape and compare it to that part on that slab over there guys strange angles to it very similar and then this huge block and then we're looking at a high res gigapan that NASA put together on Sol 4 and specifically we're looking at that block check out the straight edges and right angles to that piece that block over there is about a meter, meter and a half wide and it's got a bevel on the one side and it's very similar to the blocks and slabs that I've been showing you recently photographed by the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter from Orbit these blocks are slightly bigger but the similarity is quite uncanny yeah we see these blocks on the surface We're getting side views which is incredible also in color and then we've got some more of these blocks check out the straight edges right angles very smooth flat surfaces to those and then we're zooming in on that strange block at the back there it's also about a meter, two meters wide. Check out the odd pieces over here. We'll check those out as well. Look at the way this thing's been carved or machined. It's almost like what we do to precious stones or diamonds here on Earth. And then we're looking at these items. We've got another one of these six-sided hexagon shapes there and I estimate it to be about a meter and a half to two meters wide one two three four five strange covering over there and then the sixth side over there and then these blocks still tightly packed together there in the background and there they are for comparison they stick out like sore fingers folks amongst this boulder field and there are similar six-sided objects that are discovered on Mars these were photographed 
from orbit as well and they are slightly bigger than that one let's zoom in on that strange piece it looks like it's been sculpted or molded it's about a meter long check out the straight edges over here very smooth flat sides and there it looks like we can see some of the grooves that were left from a possible machine that carved that piece out. Then we're zooming in on that strange item. I estimate it to be about a half a meter to a meter long. Look at the strange slot that's been cut into it. And uh, we've seen similar types of slots cut into objects. This was taken by the Rover Curiosity on Sol 844. And then uh, this was photographed from orbit. Check out the strange shape in this piece. It's got a uniform thickness to it as well. Very similar to that shape there. Okay, let's have a look at the GigaPan that Joe put together. I'll include the link to this in the description as well. Let's zoom in on those blocks. This looks very much like an ancient megalithic structure. The straight line running across there looks like that block might have been on top of that. And maybe that one there was also stacked up here and it rolled off. So let's zoom in on that block there. Check out the uniform thickness to that slab. And these over here as well. block right angles parallel edges and then these multiple long narrow blocks that fit tightly underneath that and as I say it looks as if that might have been on top of that block and check out there in the background Joe also pointed this out it's strange straight edge covered in sand there is this part of an ancient structure NASA does call this the citadel that's it for this one thank you for watching as always let's have a chat in the comments below I'd love to hear your take on these potential ancient structures megalithic blocks all over the place so now we've seen them from orbit and we've seen them up close and personal on the surface the ones photographed by the Arova are slightly smaller but the geometry and shape and the symmetry are very similar thanks again for watching folks i'll see you in the next video take care